Welcome to Automate M365. In this video, I'll show you step-by-step -step how to connect a Microsoft form to a SharePoint list. This way, all responses are automatically stored in your list, useful for reporting, follow-up, or archiving. Imagine you're creating a form for a request or evaluation. By linking that form to SharePoint, you automatically collect all answers in one central place. This saves time, prevents errors, and makes it easier to work with the data in tools like Power BI or Excel. We'll start by creating a form in Microsoft Forms. Go to forms.office.com and click New Form. Add a few questions, for example, name, date, and a drop-down field. Give your form a clear title, such as Training Request Form. Done? Note down the name of the form, you'll need it in Power Automate. Next, we'll create a SharePoint list. You can use an existing list or create a new one. Make sure the columns match the questions in your form, such as name, date, and request type. It's best to use the same column names to make mapping easier later on. Now go to Power Automate. Click on Automated Cloud Flow and give your flow a name, such as Forms to SharePoint. Choose the trigger, when a new response is submitted, and select your form. Then add a step. Get response details to retrieve the submitted answers. Next, add a step to create an item in SharePoint. Choose the action, Create Item. Enter the URL of your SharePoint site then select the name of your list. Map the appropriate form fields to the corresponding columns in your list.
Save your flow. To test it, submit your form once. Then open your SharePoint list to check whether the new item has been added automatically. If everything is set up correctly, you'll see the submitted data appear neatly in the list. Create item is just one of many actions you can take based on a submitted Microsoft form. For example, you can also update an existing item, like changing the status of a ticket to completed. To share the form with other people like your colleagues. Click on Collect Responses and copy the link or directly send it with Outlook or Teams. And that's how you easily link Microsoft Forms to SharePoint using Power Automate. In the next video, I'll show you how to automatically send an email after a form is submitted. Subscribe to the channel so you don't miss it. Found this video helpful? Leave a like. Thanks for watching.